Welcome to another video. My name is Georgia Blueland, but you can also call me Sally. Um, in today's video, instead of like looking at the new update, I guess I'm gonna be training and just ranting horses that I already have. Um, I, I just kind of want to film something that's like commentary wise before I have to go to work in 30 minutes. So yeah, um, I don't know though because I really want to buy the Mustang that is at Starshine Ranch, but the thing is, is I told myself I'm not going to be buying any more horses until I train all of mine, which I've been doing really good at lately, so I want to just show you guys the horses that I have to train, so <laughs> yeah, let's go to my home stable and check it out. I know I have not been active on Star Stable really at all lately, I haven't really played the game much and I just, I miss the vibe and just the, the calmness that it brings me, and yes, I was filming a RRP, so that's why there's horses and tack out everywhere um i'm just gonna turn off my aid off so it can we can see the horses i know this is not really like a accurate representation of how many horses i have to train but i have like one page of horses left one and like a quarter of a page of horses left so that's like 18 that's like almost 20 horses i think that's like 24 horses i have to train which is not bad like because before i had to i had like a hundred horses that i had to train but i really want to train will today this horse just makes me really happy i know adding one more horse to my stable wouldn't kill me but at the same time star coins are expensive and i wasn't about to buy more star coins on double star coin weekend this week because i am saving up for an apartment um me and my friends are actually going to be moving in together so that's happening um, but yeah, I'm not gonna spend as much money on Star Stable because, you know, what's the point if you're just gonna get horses that, um, are the same from every other horse? I mean, I do like the horses and I do see the difference, but look at this horse, okay, you guys? Like, this horse is so pretty. I just, I really want to get her. Anyway, like, what would we change the mane to? Not, definitely not that. Um, oh yeah, I would love the little, like, show pony cut. Um, I don't know. I really like her. I think she is great. It's definitely a girl for me. So I do think I'm gonna get this horse just because, um, it's one of the horses I actually really like that has come out. Um, I do have 8,000 star coins left, so I'm willing to spend on this horse. Um, so let's pick out a name for her. <gasps> oh my gosh, this would be so cute. Jazzy! Jazzy! That is so cute! Okay, let's buy the horse. I know, it's so bad, but like, this horse is calling to me. Uh, so let's buy Jazzy. Let's send her to the stable. Okay, this is the last horse I'm buying before I train all my horses, like, for real. But look at this horse. Okay, this Cell France, I'm sorry, but this Bay would have to be my favorite. I just, he reminds me so much of my horse in real life, and I just, I love him. So, you know, let's go find a horse to train, because I want to do some training. Uh, because I, let's be honest, I haven't been keeping up with that very well. I do like my outfit though, so maybe I'll just stick to it. Or maybe we'll train our new horse. You know what? I, I think we're gonna do that. Let's train our new Mustang. And I pro I'm probably gonna like title this vis video like training the new Mustang because I love this horse. This horse is gorgeous. Okay. Yeah, let's 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 do this. Let's train our new Mustang. I kind of want to have a nice easygoing outfit. Um, I don't know what this horse looks good in. Yellow is kind of a cute color on this horse. All right, I'll be right back when I pick an outfit. I don't know, the pants, the pants are a vibe. 
Okay, we'll go with this. Well, this is our outfit. I think it's really cute. I want to take a picture. But let's go train our horse. Um, we do have about 20 minutes left, so I think I'm just gonna start with the route that I usually take. Um, maybe just a shorter version of that route. So let's start right here at Steve's farm. I know I usually don't start here, but I'm just gonna start from here because <laughs> why not? We're right here. Okay, so this horse is so cute. I haven't even tried the new chores yet. Like, I don't know. The chores are just not... You know what? This race is not going to do anything for me. Uh, let's take care of our horse first. And IRL has been pretty busy, so I've been, you know, kind of just going away and coping. I did have a burnout period, so I was gone for like about a week or two. I think I was gone for three weeks, actually. So I am so sorry for that, you guys. Um, but I am back and I am happy and doing well. School is going really well, actually. I found a new love for studying and reading. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have to tell you about my new hobby. So I, when I was little, I hated reading books, okay? Like, I thought it was a chore. I hated it so much. I just could not find why people loved it until now. Now that I'm older and now that I'm like 18 years old and kind of just getting out of high school, I have found a new love for reading and studying. Studying is one of my favorite ways to relax other than playing video games because sometimes video games can be too much and just overwhelming and sometimes I just need to get off the screen because I do get chronic migraines from, from screens, which I did get blue light glasses for, so that's been helping a lot, but you know, sometimes it it's not like... An immediate fix so I've been doing some reading instead of playing video games I've also been like hanging out with my IRL friends a lot and if you guys are watching this hi I love you guys so much you guys are amazing you guys have been making me so happy so glad we can hang out together and have a great time it's honestly such a blessing to have you guys around um, but yeah, and my next RRP, I want to talk about it because I'm very excited. I don't want to spoil too much because honestly, like, what's the point of watching it if you know it's going to happen? But I am going to do a barn vlog. I haven't done a barn vlog in a while and I'm very excited to do it because I have a lot of new exciting things to update you guys on. So my storyline is doing really well and it's actually coming together and I like the way I've organized it. So I've been having a lot of fun with RRP and I just, I cannot wait to continue working on it. I do have work today. So I have a four hour shift at my job and I am kind of not excited for it. I will say I'm a little, I'm kind of dreading it, but that's okay. I do have school tomorrow and it's going to be a good time, but I'm going to finish filming tonight, probably after work, just so I can get all of that done. Um, and maybe even edit this video tomorrow in class just to kind of get it out. I hope this video comes out on Wednesday. If it did come out on Wednesday, props to me because that's a great thing. I'm hoping my RRP video will come out on Saturday. I want to release RRP videos on Saturday again. I just kind of want to have a schedule. It, they might not come out every Saturday just because I don't want to force myself to make an RRP every single week. But, you know, definitely look out for commentary videos. So if I post a commentary video, it'll definitely be on a Wednesday. And if I post a RRP video, it'll be on a Saturday. So hopefully I'll get more content out and feel more organized for sure. Um, I'm definitely feeling really good about everything right now. And I'm just, I don't know, I'm just overall really happy. Also, I have a new barn manager for my RP barn, and her name is Ray. So, Ray, if you're watching this, thank you so much for being such a great friend and just person. Like, you have made this RP experience so great. And I just, I don't know. She's been doing a lot for, for our RP barn. Like, she's 
had two horses at our Hoofs for Hope um, facility and they are just wonderful. Honestly, all of the horses, even though they're not real and they're pixel horses, these horses are literally like my children. I don't think you guys understand how much RP like means to us creators but we like literally love our horses to death even if we don't know them like a lot of the time i choose my horse's personalities from horses i know or knew in real life and it brings the story to life even more I feel like I'm just rambling. Maybe I am, but maybe you guys are entertained by it. So if you want to have more yapping sessions like this, just comment down below. Like, let me know if you like to have yapping sessions like this. Like, I don't know. Do you guys, do you guys like it? Is it annoying? Is it boring? Is it fun or what is it? Like, I would really like to know. I will say I have not been doing my Path of Terra like at all lately like I was grinding hard on that okay like during the months between like January when it came out I think it came out in January um through the months of January to like March I was grinding that that path of Terra and I got really far um but once the glitch kind of like got patched I was really sad to be honest um so I haven't really been grinding the path of Terra since. I just, I don't know, I've been lazy. And there's just a lot of other things going on. And it gives me something to do in the game, I guess, other than training. So that's nice. But training is also fun. I do enjoy training a lot. Those equestrian festival races, I am going to miss deeply, though, because the 800 XP per race, that was so nice, and the way people, like, would just want to group up with you just because they could was amazing. Honestly, the teamwork that I saw during that time was, was really nice, it was really nice to see, and I just, I really loved the community in the way they were just really kind to people. It really kind of gave me some faith in humanity, I guess you could say. I don't normally do the first race to the racetrack anymore because it's just so long and you don't get that much XP during it, so I just, I skip it. Let me know if you skip it, because honestly, I would like to hear what you guys have to say about this race. Jazzy's already at level 4. She's doing amazing. I don't know, is it a girl or a boy? I think this horse is a girl. I would like this horse to be a mare. In my head, she's a mare, and she might even be in my RRP at some point, honestly. I know I have, like, so many horses, but, like, I kind of cycle them, like, through. Like, so, I'm allowed to have eight horses at a time. That's, like, the max amount of horses that I'm allowed to have. I have seven right now. I actually have eight, but I have seven at Hooves for Hope, so Malibu is kind of put to the side right now just because I don't really want to deal with him. I don't really know what to do with his storyline right now. I do love him, but since he's an old model, I just haven't really wanted to, like, excel his storyline more. I really wish um, Star Stable would update the Moaris. I would really like to see a new model or variant of the Moaris. I think they're really pretty. Um, but they're just really old models in the game, and they can't wear the new tack. They don't really look nice. Their gates are really squiggly. At first, when they came out, I loved them. I really love the Moaris. But now that they're older, and they've been out for like three years at this point, I think... It's just, I don't know, they're not really up to their standard anymore. I really want to take a picture with this horse. I don't know. Let's let's turn the, the Adolf setting on just so I can get a good thumbnail. Also, my thoughts, I want to talk about the reshade problem because the reshade problem has been very prominent in the community lately. And with reshade not working and everything, I want to say my piece because I do use reshade for my content and it's a very important part of my content. But all I'm going to say is you don't need reshade to have your content look good. Like, if you take the time to film and edit a good quality video, you do not need reshade. It is just a tool that I like to use and I'm able to use. And I... 
I do prefer using a reshade. It's like going from using shaders in Minecraft and then not using shaders. So it is kind of annoying, but just... If you can't use reshade anymore, don't fuss over it. I'm sure your content is still going to be amazing, and if you have to do a little extra editing, like, there's no harm in that. And so I just, I wanted to put that out there, because I know a lot of people were upset with the reshade thing, and I think it's great that Star Stable is trying to find a solution, even though people are literally, like, yelling at them. And this is not me being a white knight. This is not me being like, oh, Star Stable are saints, because we all know they have crappy, like, business tactics and everything. But that's, it's kind of is what it is, I guess. So, you know, I, they're all people at the end of the day, and they all have lives and families. And it's not the team that's corrupt, it's the CEO and the business, like, managers. Um, that are corrupt and you know maybe they're not even corrupt maybe they're just the way they are because that's how their way of life is and we just kind of have to accept that some people are ignorant and that's just how this world is sometimes it kind of sucks but you get what you get I guess oh I just fell into that hole I have about five minutes left to film before I have to leave because I have work today, and I literally just dropped off Nate from having to go to work. He literally works an hour before me and an hour after me. I only work from 3 to 7. He works from like 2 to 8. Also, if you hear a freaking saw outside, my grandfather and my brother are doing something, so so sorry if you hear the noise, but that's just gonna be in the background, I guess. Um, it like went off once but hopefully it won't go off too many more times because this video is is not gonna be that much longer because I have to go I literally just feel like I've been yapping this entire time over nothing and I kind of feel bad for you guys but at the same time like if you guys want to watch you will if you don't you'll, you'll click off that's kind of how it is these videos aren't for everyone some people are here for my RRPs and some people are here for commentary and RRPs also, I would like to ask the community, if I were to do a Minecraft Let's Play channel, like, or like, do like, swim videos, would you guys watch it? Like, would you guys like swim related videos or even swim related RRP videos? Because I would love to figure out how to do those types of videos for you guys. And also just for myself, because I, I really want to have like a swim bar and I think it would be so cute. I forgot how this race works. Like I usually know these races by the back of my hand because I used to do them all the time during COVID. But like I've lost practice, I will say. I will say it's been a while. Um, I have been doing like only the equestrian festival races. So it's been like a month or two since I've actually done like the all of these races. Um, I do still like them. They're they're pretty great, but you know, I have to get back into it again. I can't just be on that star stable grind immediately. All right, so I think I'm gonna end that race with that race, um, and we're gonna just kind of go to a spot. Yeah, like right here, I guess. All right, all right. Well, I'm gonna turn my my. F1 off or my interface off. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was just of me yapping and just a good old ranting session about whatever I wanted to talk about. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you didn't, I'm so sorry. It was just something I wanted to film, but you know what? Why am I saying sorry? Because this is my channel and I want to post whatever I want to. So yeah, you get this, I guess. Um, an RRP will be coming out Saturday this week, so when you see this on Wednesday, um, yeah, that'll be coming out in a couple of days, so look out for that. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate all the support from you guys, and I want to say that you'll be seeing a lot more content in the near future because summer is coming, and I'm very excited to say that I will have a lot more free time, so... Have a great day, night, or even if it's the middle of the night and you're watching this at 3 a.m., hi, I see you, I guess. I, I literally stay up until that time, too, sometimes. It's really bad. But have a great day.
and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!